Tom Cruise has been in a lot of movies lately, and I'm starting to have an issue with his age. He's 55, and he keeps playing characters that are in their 30s and 40s. The lady that plays his wife in this movie is 20 years younger than him in real life. Tom, maybe you should start picking on parts your own age. Whatever. American Made. Rapid Fire Review. The Plot. Tom Cruise plays Barry Seal, a very, very talented pilot. Some might say he's... a maverick. <laughs> Worst joke ever. <laughs> he gets recruited by the CIA to fly over dangerous areas in South America. He takes pictures and gets intel, and then he makes friends with some drug lords. And shit gets pretty crazy from there. Tom Cruise. Tom plays Barry Seal. He's not the smartest person, but he is an amazing pilot. And in this very specific time period, his skill set is something that everybody wants. Drug lords want to use him. CIA wants to use him. FBI wants to use him. The president wants to use him. And as far as the story goes, that makes for a very interesting point of view. I thought Tom was great. It was his best performance since Edge of Tomorrow. This movie actually had the same director from Edge of Tomorrow also. Coincidence? I think not. Sarah Wright. She plays Barry's wife, Lucy. I loved her character in this. She states several times throughout the movie that she does not trust her husband. She knows him that well. Even though she doesn't trust him, she still loves him. Ah. Unfortunately, I did some research. Barry Seal never had a wife named Lucy. He had two wives with different names than Lucy. So I guess they just combined the wives and made that into one wife? What the hell? Jamal Gleason. He plays the CIA agent that recruits Barry into his operation. Can we trust him? I don't know. Of course you know. You saw the movie. Shut up. Thought his performance was great. He was kind of a sleazeball, kind of a shady character. But that's what you expect out of a CIA agent. Overall, this movie was way better than I thought it would be. The story is just so interesting. I was very, very interested the whole movie. I wanted to know what was going to keep happening to this character. Because it's just crazy. Everyone's performance was great. There's comedy, suspense, drugs, guns, money, cocaine. This movie's actually very much like the movie Blow. So if you like Blow, you'll definitely like this movie. The only issue I seem to have was the history. I've seen Blow, I've seen Narcos. I don't remember anyone talking about Barry in any of these. This movie claims that he started this cartel. Whatever. I can get over that because it is a good movie. I definitely recommend it. Rapid Fire Review. Subscribe!